This is the Loot Press Rundown. One man has been arrested following a drug bust and seizure of $30,000 in illegal substances at two West Virginia vape shops. According to the Randolph County Sheriff's Office, on Tuesday, July 9th at approximately 2.30 p.m., the Randolph County Sheriff's Office, supported by the Mountain Region Drug and Violent Crimes Task Force, executed a search warrant at 95 Valley Point Drive, known as the Tobacco and Vapor Outlet, in connection with an earlier attempted sexual assault. During the search, officers discovered a large bag of suspected marijuana marijuana near the rear entrance. Additional evidence, including scales and other items, suggested the sale of marijuana. A search warrant was obtained and officers seized various legal substances, including Delta-8 non products and other federally banned synthetics. A significant amount of U.S. currency was also confiscated. Al Marty Kassam Salman was arrested at the Valley Point location for possession with intent to deliver a controlled substance. The investigation then extended to the vape shop at 1501 Harrison Avenue in Randolph County, owned by the same individual as the Valley Point store. With illegal items visible, officers secured a search warrant and seized more Delta 8 and 9 products and additional cash. The street value of the seized items was approximately $30,000 and the cash totaled over $31,000. Some products tested positive for methamphetamine. Both stores were closed for failing to pay inventory tax. After the owner paid the back taxes on July 10th, the stores were permitted to open that afternoon. The case remains under investigation with further criminal charges pending. The operation involved officers from the Sheriff's Office, West Virginia State Police, Elkins Police Department, and the West Virginia Department of Agriculture. Salmon is currently at Tiger Valley Regional Jail on a $50,000 cash-only bond.